Welcome back to another episode of Funked Up Gaming. I'm Levi, and today we're playing To The Moon. So the last episode of To The Moon, well, we're always going back in time, and we learned that um, River has some sort of medical issue, due to maybe an accident or something, and so she makes origami rabbits all the time. And when they ask her about it, she's just like, so, let's keep going. Uh, we also learned in the last episode that River has a big deal with this lighthouse. And no one knows why. But she loves the lighthouse so much that John's like, you know what? Let's just put a house up here. She's like, oh my god, I can see the lighthouse every day! And he's just like, yeah. So, we need memory links. Yay! That tree is not doing well. You should cut it down and use it for firewood. Uh, okay. Wait a minute. What? They were referring to the lighthouse as Anya, weren't they? I suppose so. Then that river... She declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse? Isn't that a bit too extreme? I've seen stranger... I've seen stranger things in the course of the job. Me too, but ugh. I can never wrap my head around it. It's none of our business anyway. She's not our client. Receive note, Anya. Probably says like Anya. Lighthouse that River likes. So, hi. Uh, hi. 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 What, where y'all going? Where, where, where you going? Hi. Are you, are you coming? What? But there were people. They were walking. How strange. We're gonna see him again. Was this like a random one-off incident? Hmm. I guess we'll keep going south. Oh, well, that does it. But now we need a memento. I guess we can just keep walking. Or not. Do. Okay. Quit doing that. Keep walking. Hey, you. I can't walk around those flowers? Holy shit. Who's a wuss now? So. I don't want to walk on the flowers. They're just too pretty. Watch, just like... It's a freaking memory. Why don't you knock it off? Crazy lighthouse lady. Okay, so I need a memento. Anything that stands out, really. Yay! Probably not the wildflowers. It, I wonder if the lighthouse can be... No, don't go! I wonder if the lighthouse can be the memento. That'd be fun. I don't know, but I'm gonna need a damn memento. Oh, crap. What the hell else could be a damn memento? There's nothing here. It's like autumn. And stupid. Because I guess this is where the house goes. Hmm. Just a nice thought. There's a down here. Not really. There is a down here. I don't know where the hell we are. Ooh, hi. It's a bunny! I found a bunny. Activate the memento. Preparing memento. Don't screw this up. Crap. It's already gonna be bad. So I need five. It seems like a good first start, but that's just gonna mess it up here. Hmm. Do this one first. Because I said so. And then do this one. That's two. Crap nuggets. Three. Four. Oh, dang, I did it! Holy shit! Trophies in the mail! Oh, dang. Okay, so, go ahead and use the memento. Yes. It's a fucking origami rabbit, even. That's right, we're only making, like, little jumps through time. So, yeah. She's still making rabbits. And this, this might be the first rabbit. He's like... The fuck is this rabbit doing here? Fuck it, I'll put it on the desk. River? I 
Okay. Can I go ahead and collect stuff while I'm up here? A yellow paper rabbit. Dear Lord, not again. Oh, yeah. It's probably this whole game with the bunnies. God, I remember when I went in the first room with the bunnies. And I was just like, okay, back away slowly. It's okay. That's not the same bedroom, is it? Oh, this isn't the same house. They haven't built the house yet. Hi. An old baby grand piano. How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? They hired somebody. Who knows, but I bet it... <laughs> I bet it'd be a piece of cake for the TARDIS. Out of context joke is out of context. Not really. You can't even get it through its door. Well, not with that attitude. Hmm, true. Well, that settles it. Moving pianos is a pain in the ass for everybody. It'd probably take an entire episode to get it inside. <laughs> I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. Me neither. Sounds pretty epic. Yeah, epic Doctor Who episode of piano moving. By the way, the ninth Doctor's the best. Uh-oh. I think I know where this is going. It's a box. New boxes of plain paper. Where, where, where do you think it's going? Whoa! Oh. I'm an idiot. You went out for a haircut this more, this early in the morning? I'm, you went out for a haircut this early in the morning? Um... What are you making there? <laughs> rabbits. I'm sorry, rabbits. Did you see the rabbit I left for you? Yep. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. Um, it was yellow. What else? A bit puffy. And? Well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know how else to describe it. Oh, apparently he's missing the point. You're acting strange, River. Is something wrong? River? Don't fuck with her shit. I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. Does that mean where you don't know what's coming? I don't think I think I know of her condition, but this is rather odd even for that. You think she's Do you? Perhaps, who knows? Way to not say what it is. But like you said, she's not our client. It's fair. Let's just, let's just get what we're paid for over with. We already got the bunny from upstairs. Any more bunnies? There's a bucket. Oh, she cut her own hair? Ew, many strands of orange hair. She cut her own damn hair? That's disturbing. So this is the day she started it, huh? Okay, so I need a memento. The platypus. Yes. Fucking platypus. Someone's gonna have to explain to me the platypus, too. I still wanna know what her damn condition is. Maybe she's like... Maybe she has Alzheimer's, but I doubt it. I don't know. Ideal. Three moves. Hmm. Let's go one. I can't go that way. Whoa! This one's tall. I don't like that. Two? <laughs> so it's already bad. Three. Four. Five. Uh, six. Okay, I, I took me two more moves. Seven. There you go. Ah, oh, platypus. So. Go ahead and do the memento. Activate the memento! Yay! Supersonic man out of you! 
Don't stop me now. We're not going back very fast, are we? I mean, yeah, we're in this one now, but damn. Hey, we're gonna go all the way back to when he was like, oh, we have to convince his kid self that he goes to the moon. I remember now. So now we're on the road. On the road again. There's a car here with a platypus in it. The hell's up with that? It's not our car. We locked our car first. Apparently we can walk right, we can't walk to that tree, but just walk right through that car. That makes a lot of sense. Oh, I know where we are. We're at the base of the grounds. There was a squishy rock here the last time we were here. To which no one really explained the squishy rock, so I'm just saying. Unexplained squishy rock is unexplained. Hashtag, you know, conspiracy squishy rock theories. Okay. I'm sure something will happen at some point. And we're not just walking around like a bunch of derps. I want these flowers. Hey, you. No. I want these. No. Hey. That's the thing. There's so much stuff going on. Like, you can walk through cars, but you can't walk through that flower. Why? This is where the house used to be, isn't it? The house that never should have been. I mean, really, what's so unusually high and da- What is it about you unusually high and dangerous places that attracts people? <laughs> Receive note. Acrophobia. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was cool. Stop doing that. I'm gonna go up here. Bounce, bounce. There's a thing here. Oh, there's people here. There's, I guess, the lighthouse. Oh, the light's on. Cool. Is that why you approached me back then? Yeah. What about now? I suppose it's just a part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too relevant now, but Izzy said I should tell you the truth. Did you quit lying to your wife? It shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. Dude, John has some angry eyebrows. Oh, are you leaving? Oh, don't be like that. What is that? A hacky sack? A hacky sack? Can you throw this as far as where Anya's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? Okay. What the fuck? River! Are you insane? Get away from there! What the fuck is going on? It's getting weird. I think this memory isn't too far from the last. Think they may be connected? Probably. I want to go this way. Okay. I found the memento. I'm short one. Probably have to go across some other logs. Why did she cut her hair anyway? I like long hair. Oh, pfft. that was the last memento. Good job. Yay. Ideal. Four moves. Oh, this is easy. One, two, three, four. That was easy as shit. Come on, game. People in the comments were like, it's been easy the whole time, Levi. Oh, that's the torn up patch backpack. Why do they have it? Just for like long trips to the lighthouse? Whatever. Meanwhile, in the bookstore, I guess. Everyone's a little different, John. Okay. Just because she and I share the syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. But you must be able to help somehow. Everything was okay at first, but now she's even more aloof than before. Even when we're in the same room, she's never really there. It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to make, take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, but many of us are... But many of us do long for connections. 
though being able to articulate is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it doesn't mean it doesn't mean that she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? Oh, I don't know. Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. That's pretty difficult to do day in and day out. I know. Wait. But why do you seem so normal, Izzy? I mean, don't you have the same condition? For one, I was diagnosed when I was still young. With effort, it's not impossible to acquire a guise of social norms systematically. But you know what? I both envy and pity River. She's like over the book rack, like, I can fucking hear you. Me, I'm an actress because I've been doing it all of my life. Not only on stage, but off stage, and at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. It's the only way for me to be normal. But River, she never did that. She remained an outcast, refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if it was by choice or by limit, but whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore, and then I realize it's too late. That the Isabel that people know of is not an act, and the real me has long become a stranger. Dude, what are you, an introvert? I think in the end, I just envy her. Okay. I guess. I guess that's us sitting there. Huh. I've never met a woman with it before. And technically, you still haven't met one. That, fair. This isn't, this isn't part of our business. Let's move. Well, I think that does it for this episode of Funked Up Gaming. I'm going to stop here. So, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Down below. And as always, love you guys. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.